Hey guys, it's uh, late November, possibly early December by the time you see this video. Um, we're kind of in a transition period here in Northern Ontario where we're looking at bull launches that are frozen up and sketchy ice, but also some open lakes as well. So we're kind of uh, in between seasons here right now. So I figured I'd take the opportunity to go through a few of my favorite fall and winter baits, um, whether it's in a boat or through the ice. Um, the first bait that I actually wanted to talk about is the Johnson Splinter Spoon. You may have seen this spoon um, in my last video with Matt where we caught the absolute snot out of some bass and some walleye. This spoon is very simple. It's a gold spoon. Um, it's flat and it has some good flutter but it's basically a lift and drop technique for this spoon. Uh, it does work quite well on lethargic fish so give it a try this fall or winter. Um, it won't let you down. The next bait I wanted to talk about is made by Johnson. It's called the Johnson Johnny Darter and it's a jigging style bait. So this bait has a lot of horizontal swing and it has a lot of gliding motion. So it's very good when you're looking at fishing out of a hole. Um, you're able to cover a lot of distance underwater and it's great for catching a lot of walleye. So give this bait a try. This is the Johnson Johnny Darter. Next bait I've got here is a rattle bait. This is the Berkeley War Pig. Uh, this is the quarter ounce size. This can be used in the fall, in the winter, in the ice, um, in open water as well. Um, it's in a gold color here, which is one of my favorites, quarter ounce style. Um, lots of vibration. That's the key. Lots of rattles in it, and it can call in some fish that are feeding actively, and you can usually get them to bite it. So give it a try. Last but not least, the Sibyl Vibrato. This is a seven gram size bait. I don't know if you can see that right there. Um, this bait gives off a ton of vibration when you rip it up and then you let it flutter down. Um, it's got a lot of calling power, but at the same time you can jig it in place and get fish to commit to it. So give this bait a try. Um, we're basically getting close to Christmas, so a lot of these baits are great to use for stocking stuffers, but make sure you leave the packaging on, because the hooks are very sharp. Cheers and tight lines, everyone.